Welcome to the voice of iLeague and let's quickly go through the news. First off, starting with the bidding system, AIFF committee sits down with PricewaterCoopers team over a video conference where they uh, submit their report after evaluating the bids from Sudeva FC, Srinidhi FC and Rinthi SC for participation in the iLeague. After a lot of evaluation, it was concluded that more clarification is needed in this matter. So by 5th of August, the final reports have to be submitted and then the documents will be evaluated and then the final decision will be taken regarding the participation of these three teams in the upcoming I-League season. Next up, Jan Lo has been appointed as the new head coach of Mohammedan SC. He's the youngest A-licensed coach in India and he has been a former Minerva Punjab head coach. And uh, yes, uh, the last season, he had a breakthrough season where he performed really, really good as a coach of Minerva Punjab. The players have been revived. The team has seen a different brand of football under him. And of course, uh, we are looking forward to see that in Mohammedan as well. It's not only good for the uh, Mohammedan team, but it's also great for Bengal football and I-League second division in general as the gameplay. Uh, he's young and uh, the ideas that he can Bring, on, uh, bring to the table is going to be uh, worth a lot. And we have seen that change in Minerva Punjab in the last season. They performed brilliantly under his guidance. And also, as a, as his reputation says, he is uh, reputed uh, uh, on, the, on terms where he's very good at, at man management. And yes, uh, he's as young as the players, if not younger. Uh, so this is a very... Uh, what do I say? It's a very, very plus and very positive outlook for the team or having a very, very young manager. So the ideas of the team, not only the team is going to grow as players, as a team, but overall structure of the team might change under his guidance. But it's it's football, so we have to wait it out and see how he performs. Uh, of course, we can't wait to see him on the sidelines uh, of Mohammedan SC. Uh, also in the CFL as well. So Bengal football and I-League are going to benefit from this. So if you like this, share, subscribe and to stay updated, of course, ring the bell icon. So you will stay updated with all the I-League news. So this is Voice of I-League presented by Quad Sports. Hope you liked it and we'll see you in the next one.